Hi there, I'm Sarah Hansen, and today I'm going to um, show you how to pack your palette and uh, get ready for a trip and change out the pans in your palette, in your watercolor palette. Um, so this is a nice palette to use when you're traveling. Um, it's just an easy open shut case. There's many different varieties of these types of palettes. It has a mixing tray in the bottom, a little paintbrush here. Um, and what's nice about this palette is it's filled with half pans. And there's many different types of these palettes that are filled with half pans. But what's wonderful about this is if you don't like the color that you have in your half pan, or for instance, if it gets completely depleted and you've used it, then you can um, simply add more paint or change out the half pan. And so that's what I'm gonna show you today. It's a really nice way to get ready for traveling. And um, so what you wanna do is remove these half pans. So you can basically just pull these pans out. Typically speaking, they pop right out. Uh, the manufacturers will prepackage these a lot of times with colors in them. Here's one that has a color in it from the manufacturer. You can see it's kind of a cake, cake color there. This one I think I may have filled on my own. If the pans don't come out very easy, what I do is I take a, a knife or a palette knife and I kind of go along the edge. If I've been painting quite a bit, then sometimes these don't want to come out. So I go along the edge and loosen them up. And try not to break them, right? Loosen those up and then they just pop right out, okay? Then you go on to Amazon, I think that's where I got this. These are um, empty watercolor paint pans. I bought 20 of them. And uh, 20 of these empty pans come to you, just like this, okay? And then what you wanna do is you wanna take your color your liquid color, and this can be all your favorite colors. And you simply unscrew the lid and fill them up with a bunch of color. I fill them all the way to the top if I can. All right. And then what you wanna do is just basically place that pan right into here and drop it in. Now, interesting thing that I've had happen to me is when I've been traveling, uh, these paint pans will sometimes fall out. Oopsie, poor little guy there. They will fall out and that's not so good. So what you might wanna do is take uh, some foam tape. There's a giant roll of foam tape here and cut off a little tiny piece Place it on the bottom of your half pan before you fill it. Push it on there nice and steady. Peel the end, end, uh, end part off there. And then you want to just place it right into your palette. Press it down. Fill it up. And you can easily um, remove that once, you know, just pry it off with that palette knife if you need to get that out of there again. The other thing I've done is, uh, if I'm on an especially long trip, I like to put my tube colors into a Ziploc bag for travel and put it into the check-on luggage because you don't want to have a bunch of these tubes um, with you on your carry-on, although I think you can. Um, but I checked with my airlines before I did that. And then you can put this into your uh, check-in luggage, and it's a good way to travel, and you have all of your very, very favorite paint paint's all ready to go. What you want to do is after you fill these up, you want to leave them for a couple of days, let them thoroughly dry, and then you can fold up your palette and pack it into your suitcase. I also like, you can see all this color here. It was from painting kind of crazy one day. So I like to put this into a Ziploc bag as well so that it doesn't get my clothes and other things all messy and contains that water runoff that sometimes happens. So once these dry, you can pack them into your, even your carry-on, you can pack them into your carry-on or your check-in and um, they'll be all set for some beautiful pictures uh, for your trip with your beautiful favorite colors. All right, that's it for today. Happy painting and have a great trip. Thanks. Bye-bye.